previously on A D N D. Sorry, I keep forgetting why we're. We're looking for the dude who infiltrated. I seriously. But we can't figure out where in the world he is. Like we have no way of tracking him. You see, it looks. It's. It is a cargo log. The lines. It is race and station and where they were taken from. This is a. This is a slave log. So you walk out, and then Vala follows. From behind you, you feel a knife stick right here. A knife? A knife. Ro. Wait, did we recognize it? Uh, mm-hmm. And as, it. as she pulls out the knife. She's the chick that we didn't, we promised not to kill. <laughs> this doesn't have to end with you dying. So, so like, it's literally all it does is make them not able to yes. run away. There's no disadvantage to their attack or anything. I don't think. I think I'm that's. Grapple I think that's restrained. Town's like. Um, what's going on? So. This is the chick that we promised the one guy we wouldn't kill. I want to give her one hit point. They, yeah, I'm going to force feed her one good berry. Stepping on her <laughs> foot. Which of your companions can shapeshift? That would have been Alex the sorcerer. Uh, I turn. To Ripley. What's your name? To the ripped dude. Ripley. I mean, he's made it canon. <laughs> Carson. I will chop her head off now. Carson. 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 She'll be yours. I don't want her. I don't care what happens to her. I feel like maybe you should make this public. How public do you want it? Um, as public as you're willing to go, I guess. I just, I want it to be clear that it was done by the slaves that she held. That justice was served. Do you remember giving these stones endurance? Because it's written on my character sheet, and I remember yeah. when we reduced did... damage by D12 yeah. plus your I totally had no idea I could do that until now. <laughs> oh my god. I've already set up alternate leadership positions, which we're yeah. leaving, so we don't have to worry about Yeah, that, Reckon so. and the Warden are co leading. Right. I don't know how much is left for us in the city. And, um, Besides my dad, but I should probably run from him. Yeah. For now. Got time more... with me to wait for my sister in law. She's got means of transportation. She has <laughs> means of swift transportation. Go. Okay. Yay! <laughs> Your wife's letting you come out and play. <laughs> <laughs> I've had a dream the last two nights of a dark mass moving south along the peninsula. Alright. So reckon and word and come. Reference! Yep. Alright. Um, so, it's time we need to head north to take care of some things. We want you to continue trying to make, find an alternative location to um, move the, the den should threats come. Because uh, we feel like we've done a pretty good job of eliminating those who know about this space, but we can't guarantee your safety. Um, so continue finding a, an alternative home, um, and we'll figure out a way for you to let us know where that is if you move, have to move. <laughs> what we're well, going. We'll like, yeah, if we come back. That's true, we'll have the stone. Yeah, we can uh, do that. The other thing is we have some more information about growing things underground um, and it looks like they've had some relative success so we want to keep you guys working on that project because um, if we can... I'm the one to follow up that information. Yeah, we'll get it before you leave. Before we leave we'll get it from him. Um, council member Talon has it. Um, but he's talking with wife. Yeah, um, it's been a while <laughs> since they've seen each other. Um, so they probably want to spend some time together. Um, but Stop we'll... doing a lot of talking. I was leaving that! <laughs> <laughs> um... They're married! <laughs> Still, <laughs> we have to talk about, talk about other people's business. Okay. Um... So Fallen is you have great people? social skills. That's true. Um... Oh, there's Eleven. One. Eleven. <laughs> But yeah, so yeah, we'll get you that information and have you keep working on that as well. Um, is there anything you need from us before we leave? No. Okay. Um, anything you want to add, Bob? No. Okay. Maybe? No. 
I'm trying to think if I like learned anything. Um, so quick question. Did you guys take the dagger that she stabbed you with? Oh, see, I did think about Yeah, I thought we took her weapons. I took her, because she dropped it after she stabbed me. I took her scimitar, oh. but the knife was left on the ground. And oh, I thought I you told, just took everything. I thought about taking it, but I didn't say anything. I thought I heard you say, I take the scimitar. Okay. I said, well, I said I searched her for weapons. But if it, it wasn't, wasn't on her, then. On. Yeah, it wouldn't have been on her. Okay. So, Dang probably it. not then. All right. I was kind of feeling about that. But. Yeah, it's okay. I didn't even think about it because I don't use daggers, so. No. That's true. I but I mean, I could if it's a cool oh, that would take it. Yeah, like, well, you could just throw it, too. I feel like this isn't yeah. helpful to me. Which I do okay with because I'm pretty dexterous as well. Dexterous. Um, Alright, yep. so. There's other fish in the daggers in the world. Right. <laughs> fish in the sea that are really fire. Um, that's all I think we have. Um, but. We'll take. We'll leave in the morning. So if you think of anything you need from us before we leave, uh, don't hesitate to ask. Um, we will want somebody to show us how to. Do we want to leave through the north, the, the north tunnel? Exit, yeah, that leads into the woods. Yeah, I mean, there's done? no reason to go through town. We've mm -hmm. got what we need. Oh, Rations. you might want to go through town to go get ghost. Oh, and yeah. then I have a way, like a, a, a car again. Yeah. So maybe you want to meet us with outside the city. With beer. With beer. We don't know that. Oh, the, no. the parts. I was there with ghosts. So I was oh, obviously. okay. Oh, you no, did. Yeah. It's not. That. It's not beer. It's, it's the materials, materials for beer. Okay. Do you oh, and Bala want to do that, and we'll meet you on the outskirts of the city, or do you want to just do that by yourself? Oh, wait, I don't have good berries. I could. Oh, just kidding. I'm not here. He's not there. Um, just I just wanted to point out that one good yeah. berry yeah. is enough food to. It sustains. It sustains a person for a day. So just but one, not just one. one. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. It also restores it's one, one hit point, but it, you're not hungry for a day. <clears throat> um, but I it doesn't matter for her because she died. I wish if no, I know. I'm, I'm just assuming. thinking for like rations because I have yeah, yeah. nine left, so I don't feel like. I yeah, really and I mean I'm used to living in the woods like, some, so I'm probably okay with hunting too. So. But I have so I have till oh, seven way. p.m. of tomorrow before the um, cancer goes away, and they're just regular berries. Reckon I have a question before I send you on your way. Um, okay. Do you have any means of quick yeah. communication with someone far away? Do you have like a courier system? Um, no. No. Okay. So he's dead. All right. I might actually. I'll take Talon up to the city tomorrow, and we'll go get his cart. You're going to. Do that? Yeah. I'm going to send a message. Okay. Um, I will stay. Oh, actually, I do want to stay in here. I have stuff. Oh, no. I could do that tonight. Tomorrow morning. Oh, yeah. Well, when we leave, some of us will leave through the city and some will leave through the tunnel. Okay. Alright, never mind then, Reckon. If you don't have tra um, a way of doing that, then I don't, um, I don't need anything else from you. And again, if you need anything from us, let us know. Alright. And I'm dead. Did I put this? Where did I put this thing? Dang it. Alright. So, in the morning then. Night. <laughs> <laughs> I go to my room. And right. I go to sleep. So you have a few items. Okay. Um, I don't know what you guys are doing with those. Just a reminder, you, you have items. I was going to say, yeah, I was about to address that here in a minute. Aha! There it is. Because it's what? Nine? Yeah. Yeah, something like that. Okay. So, in my room. I don't think I have items. I'm good. You, have, yeah, oh, you, band. you have a oh, band. Oh, that's right. I have the snake. Band. And I have the coat. And. Did I, I have slid two things? Hmm? I have two things. Does he have two things? Me? Yes, he has two things. Yeah, that's what I thought. But I don't, I don't think you're doing any two things. We, I have two things. <laughs> just first of all, so the the cape that was just a cape, right? There. It's okay. There's a really nice like Good. warm okay. cape. Because I was, I was like, I swear, if that's another thing. Okay. No, it's not. So, um, as I'm as I'm um, like right before I go to bed, I'm gonna take the time and like study the hand axe. All right. So you study the hand axe. That should be arriving to you in a minute. 
Um, I think he just sent you something. <laughs> It'll happen. I was trying my, to like. My yeah. alert. My alert's turned on. Oh dang. Okay. Turn it on. Um. Okay. Now try to protect it. All right. Nice job. <laughs> um. And then I'm all right. Are you attuned to anything or? Sure. The snake thing. Yeah. Okay. So here's that. Oh. How do you pronounce that name? Fang. Oh, that's an F. Oh, I thought yeah. that was an E. Because <laughs> no, it's like it's, an it's, yeah. really, it's that. really it's interesting. interesting. Look, it looks like an oh, E. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah. It took it took me a while. I had to, I had to like read the descri description before I went. Oh, <laughs> that's what that is. Oh gosh. Oh. Yeah. So I just always have a plus two to my AC. Yes. Okay. As long as you're wearing it. Well, yeah, I'm wearing my fingers. Wasn't there, when I created, I think it's on my computer one, but, um, when we created, what, didn't I, am I proficient with leather working tools, or was that was a thing that I did, chose, or something? Yes. So, does that mean I can make my own armor for the wolf? You could, it would. I mean, you need but supplies. I would need, I would need leather. You need leather, and it would be a series of leather worker checks. How long would that? Like course of days, like a course of days. If you're just working on it, like before like at you, night, at like night, it would take you probably, depending on your roles, maybe like a week okay. to get it all done. And how much would it improve the AC? Um, depending on what kind of leather you would make it. Leather. What's its dex modifier? Plus two. Plus two. So you could make it have an AC of thirteen. Ooh. What is it? Wait, it now? already has an AC of 13. AC of 13? So the highest you could get it is 14. Oh. And that would take a little while longer if you wanted to just give it leather armor. Um, but then can I add to the armor as it goes? I mean, yeah. Like add like metal plating or like chain mail or something yeah. like that as it goes. You can do that. And it would increase it further? Um, then 14? Or is there a cap? Uh, What's well, I mean, the highest you can get is plate, and it's 20 pounds, or uh, tw AC of 20, but it is but real heavy. Right, and it was um, slowing down. So... Yeah, you're, you're, that, that, well, what's its strength? I'm just about to write 12. 12? 12? 12 plus 1. Um, like that's a... its speed would be 30. Yeah, so it'd cut it by 10. Yeah, okay. if you put it in plate. But, like, you can you can add some metal and stuff and make it better than a 14. Right, okay. okay. So we have options. Good to know. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Okay. okay. Wait, hang on. Okay, I should probably just at least do my HP stuff, right? Yep. That's the no, yeah. This may or may not be another episode. So it's a deep... This one? Ten, kind of yeah. No. Or the medium. Well, you've been rolling for it. I can't like go back on it now. Well, that's. I wish I could go back on it. Um, <laughs> I mean, it it's yeah. only a. Kind of got caught. Plus my. Age. Constitution modifier. Well. Um, so I just plus four. It's okay. You rolled max the last time. Right. And um, also. So you now you're 26, big, right? You're 26. You also do really good when it comes to. So we're 24, 25, 26. <laughs> You also do really good when it comes to like getting ten necrotic damage or like yeah, you've been healing a lot. Points back. Like I haven't had to heal. I have a hard time things. choosing my maneuvers. My for that. Maneuver, yeah. I so, have three. And then okay, so just re-clarifying that I need to pick one, one more, more spell, first level spell. One more first level spell, and then is that the only other thing I need to do to level up? Yes. Okay, so now we can continue, and I'll finish writing this out. And okay. <sighs> Bummer, it's intelligence is three. <laughs> Bummer. With it minus four. It does understand you right. all the time though. Yeah, it's telepathic. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Um Just yep. a curious question. Yes. Can I speak? Is there any with other kind of question? Animal? With mine? Yeah. Why? Oh, well, really specific to that spell. Speak please. with animals? Yeah. Would that work though for a, a familiar that's taken? Or animal friendship, like that kind Typically of thing. Yes. Say, what are the specifics of uh, speak with animals? Speak with animals is you gain the ability to comprehend and verbally communicate with beasts for the duration. The knowledge and awareness of many beasts is limited by their intelligence, but at minimum, beasts can give you information about nearby locations and monsters, including what they can perceive and have perceived within the past day. 
So, Fey and Beast are different, so no. Okay. Fey creatures are from the Fey Wild. That's a fun place. Do they, just, do they so fall silly. under, like... Because, like, I can, like, charm creatures or something like that. Can I, like... Um, uh, if, if it's beasts, no. Uh, uh, Animal Friendship wouldn't work, I don't think, because I think it's beasts. I'm talking about, I think it's, what is it called? My Channel Divinity or whatever? It was oh, your Channel Divinity. It's oh. like charming creatures, I think. Yeah. I don't remember that's, the, point, what, the word. That's, so, uh, it, it's nature domain. I don't think that's in the book. Nature domain's in the book. It is? It's base, yeah. I don't, I never play with work, so. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Um, I played a nature player. Um, yeah, so. Uh, I don't know the specific Charm name. animals and plants. So as an action, you present your holy symbol and invoke the name of your deity. Um, each beast or plant creature that can see within 30 feet of you must make a wisdom saving throw. If the creature fails its saving throw, it is charmed by you for one minute or until it takes damage. While it's charmed by you, it's friendly to you and other creatures you designate. So no. Okay. Because it's a thing. Um... All right, so you guys wake up in the morning. And I get all my spells. He can't charm or talk to your familiar. Ha! I'm just curious. You're just jealous that I can speak to animals and you can't. I can speak to animals. I can speak to horses through Mr. Sir Pickles. <laughs> Mr. Sir Pickles. I have a translator. Yeah. I took Zone of Truth because that might be helpful. Okay, you took Zone of Truth. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. We talked about this. So, today I'm feeling like I'm going to go with Cold. Cold? Alright. Sounds good. I don't know what I want to go. Do I want to be able to make you guys do things? Or no. just to make myself just make yourself, do things? Make yourself be a. Yeah, but what's really cool is I can um, actually command you to attack. Oh, never mind. Do and that. give you an option to make a strike, or after I hit a creature, I can tell you to move and move you into a more advantage, yeah, do advantageous that. Do position. That. Is that commanding strike? There's commander strike, which is the one where I basically give them one of my attacks, oh. um, which right now I only have an attack and then my bonus, my oh, offhand. Right. So that would just mean I don't attack this turn. I just give them my attack, correct? Because I wouldn't get my offhand attack, or would yes. I? That's my bonus. You're not taking the attack action. Okay. You're telling someone else to uh, attack. So is it really actually? So at a higher level, that might be better because yeah. I'll have an extra attack. Maneuvering attack is when I hit a creature with a weapon attack. I can expend a superiority to die die to, to die. move one of you guys. Um, uh, half your movement, and you don't take opportunity attacks. So I can basically move you out of an attack with one person and get you like 15 feet away, or I can move so, you to be flanking with someone or something. That'd be cool, though, honestly. Uh, so, so honestly, if you landed your first strike, you could command them to flank the person you're attacking. And I'd get advantage. With advantage. Uh, but yeah. you already... Oh, no, that's with initiative. Um, Okay. So with so with this companion is it only reacts? No, it has all the actions. All right. Oh, I'll so it does do all these things. Keep... Um, it can't. It does not take the attack action. It can do everything else. So it doesn't have the bite melee. Use no reaction instead of waiting. Okay, for but it has these attack. traits. Can basically... Yes, it has all the traits. It has the all traits, of the efficiencies, the stats, no, the advantages three. on. I think smell perception. So sweeping attack. Basically, if I hit a creature and there's another creature within five feet of it, I can. Sure, but I mean, like, so what? So what I'm trying hit to figure out is how I use them. it in I my can also. That oh, right, because it, it says it rolls damage. initiative on it. And, you know, so it rolls initiative, so you can have it one up. Uh, you can you can cast your two wounds through it. Um, but you can so also extension of my reduce the damage. Basically, you can also have it run up and distract uh, a enemy by like snapping at its ankles. Yeah, I mean I only have four and then and then I would gain advantage. Everyone. Everybody so was hitting that striking distance. Yeah. Everybody, everybody would gain advantage on attacks against the person. Against the person. Against, against the person, distracted. yeah. And does that have a limit? Of how many times or how many attacks? You just say it takes the help action on its turn. 
And it, so help action is like its thing in a text. I'm just trying to write t to know how to remember this. Yeah, sure. like like this, it would probably, it's, it's probably its best trait is yeah. it can be summoned back. Right, um, so I can blip it in and out of existence. Yes. <laughs> in and out of ex so I can teleport it around. Yeah, okay. Yeah, cool. On um, it, it, it doesn't turn, appear but within five feet of me, though. See, you don't have like 30. 30. Hang on. What would it say? Hang on. I. It was on the other page. Hang on. I'm pretty sure it said 30, but. Because magic items are fun. Because it, it, was it was 30, but it also is in a Which is what all the space. Are. Right. Yeah. So I can't, yeah. Well, I needed to figure that out first. That's not at all what that was previously paged. Okay. Alright. So, you yes. wake up in the morning. What are you guys doing? And I didn't have time last night to get the. Yeah. Uh, you can cast it to reappear in any unoccupied space within 30 feet of you. Oh, cool. Okay. Attuned to my coat. I assume. Um, did you? You have to tell him that you did, or that you're doing that. I think for a part of it, well, can see? Do I have to like only focus on that, or like yes. can I like casually talk with someone? And is that? Uh, generally, it's most of your attention is focused on. Okay. It's like meditation, Josh. Anyway, I told you you shouldn't have done that. Done what? Attuned to your coat. I was hanging out with my wife. Right, but you also have been carrying that coat around for two days. Three, I know. Three. I haven't three, had just two cat like four? an hour. <laughs> no, well, it would be three. It would be three, three, three days. days. How, three long, days. how long does it take to attune? An hour. hour. An hour. I don't have. I mean, we haven't had a spare hour. I literally. Oh, that's true. You did. Okay. Yeah. Well, maybe you weren't too busy <laughs> with your wife. Maybe you'd have better time. <laughs> anyway. How about that? Is there a list of its reactions? Uh, it's if, there, if there is something that is listed as a reaction, so like, um... On the wolf stats? Or... Yeah. Okay. Yeah, or, or like an action, like to do something that is a reaction, that is that is something. So like, uh, rogues, rogues at 5th level can use the reaction to half the damage of a melee attack against them. Uncanny dodge. Uncanny dodge. So that is their reaction. Um, some spells like counterspell can be used as a reaction. So if someone is casting a spell, they use the reaction to say, no. And then they basically destroy the spell before it's cast. So reactions are a special brand of bonus action that is done in response to something. So Do this, you... But this wolf stuff I'm looking at doesn't have any reactions. Yeah. So. Okay, so we wake up. Mm. Except for casting spells. Oh, whoa. Through, through it, he used the reaction. Right. Oh, so it does have it has it has advantage on its action rolls against creatures if attack roll one of the wolf's That's allies is within yeah within five feet. So basically, I could cast and the distracting. I could cast the distracting thing if we're both within range. You you gain pack tactics, oh, which yes. which is flanking. But as long as it's with that five. wolf is within five feet, you don't have to be on the other side. So it could be standing right next to me, and I'm standing in front of the guy, and yeah. it gives me advantage? Yes. Wolves are nasty. Oh, I love this thing. Oh, what am I going to name him? Wolves have been nasty, boys. All right. I'm just going to call Kobolds him also have nasty. Pack <laughs> <laughs> nasty. No, oh, uh, boy. <laughs> McNasty and Sir, and, and Sir Pickles. <laughs> All right, so do you spend some time in the morning doing that to, to get your familiar up, Jacob? Oh. Do you spend some time doing that in the morning? This, yes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kind of go ahead and cast it. Okay. Do it. So he is, um, he comes out and he sits with the ha with the uh, hand axe, um, kind of in his lap, for about an hour. Oh, um, can I turn to the cupboard in the morning? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Yeah. Okay. Come here. Ow. <laughs> Um, so yeah, and then after, I'll wait till he gets back in to describe that part. Yeah. That, that's cool. Um, basically when we take off though, just so you're aware of what I want to do. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, please tell me. <laughs> yeah. When we're headed back to get, um, his, mm. oh, you sent a message, didn't you? Like mail. 
or you found out where they're I found out where from. it is. Okay. Yeah, I can take you. Cool. Yeah. When we go to get my mm -hmm. thing, or we'll do that first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll go with you. Well, I don't remember where it was. It's up here, so we, we it's, can go it's through It's up kind of, it's up south of the Death Star thing. Okay, so on the way, we can... So, yeah, on our way out. This, this is near the Academy. Okay. Just so we knew so we have a reference point. You characters don't know that, but I don't want to keep telling you. The Academy. Okay, but yeah. the post office the thing academy. you said was south of the it's Death Star? It's south of the Academy. Oh, of the Academy. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's on the opposite. It's pretty sweet, way. isn't it? Yeah. 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 Oh, I'm going to grab my computer. Oh. Um. Alright. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. Yeah, I want to go send a message to that dude. Alright, to the... Do you tune to it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tune to it! As a plus one to armor. All right. I'll find his name while we're looking. And this whole time you could have been running with a plus one to your AC. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, so I could have a knight. I have a 19 AC. Stop it! <laughs> um, but is that all it does? Well, um, yeah. I can also change the appearance um, of yourself? No, of the armor. Oh, so basically. So it doesn't. Not, it, he can make it now. He can make it look like a coat. So it's like not uh, armor. It's it's glamour studded armor is what it's called. You uh, as as a bonus action, so you can change it, the appearance. Instead of it like, looking like, to like different classes of armor, or just to make it low like low key. To make it look like a jacket or a robe. But that or, doesn't change. That the, doesn't change so the weight or the physicality. Yeah, so you literally can change. Your but people from a distance will like, like look at him and like squishy. <laughs> like, so yeah. like yeah, so he could literally just walk in and like, oh, this is more of a high society class yeah, party, and then change it to like a tux. Yeah. yeah. Oh, cool. That's cool. Um, <gasps> it's it's you could pose as like this like foreign diplomat and like have these like weird extravagant. How's outfits. your deception? Oh yeah. Um, Remember, we're not a charismatic group. So, so what is what is that? Can you, can you read part of that? Uh, plus one. The first the first <laughs> part of that to me, Josh. Oh, boy, it's yeah. glamour study. It should be twelve plus dex, Josh. It should be 12 13, plus dex, but it's a plus one armor set. 13 plus dex. It says 13 plus dex. 13 plus dex, which is 16, oh. plus the one. What was <laughs> that? I think that was a funny bone. No, that was just my elbow. That was just taking this, like, the skin and just crunching it. Oh, no. Yeah. That so that funny. should be 13 plus 3, which is 16. Okay. And then the plus one should make it a 17. My back too long. What does that do? What's say that again? So, so 13 plus dexterity modifier. So 16. So and then it's a plus one armor set. So it's 17. Not 19. I don't know, where are we getting that from? Because I currently have 18. Right. So it's not a plus one to the 18. No, no, no. It's a plus one to the armor, the armor itself. You don't put armor on top of armor. You are one set of armor. Okay. Um, have I not been wearing armor this entire time? No, you've been wearing armor this entire time. Yeah, but it just hasn't you, been. You've been, been wearing been... base class armor. You've been wearing like chainmail or something. Okay. I don't know what it is. But wearing the two, <laughs> now you get a plus one to your. Armor. But wearing the two of those at the same time does nothing. Does not. Does I actually lose. You you lose weight. one point off your AC. You bring it to a seventeen if you put on the glamour style leather, instead of the stuff you started with. But you so can I have change a higher armor class with the stuff that I was wearing originally. Yes, but so you better can change stats, the stats, better stats, or the ability to look cooler, is what I'm hearing. So it could, it's useful, it's just not necessary. I mean, I won't And you can have it attuned, but you're just not wearing it. You're just being your backpack. Yeah. And then you can throw it on. It takes a minute to don okay. the leather armor, I think. Uh -huh. So you can put it on for you. I mean, that's 10 rounds of combat. I'm not doing all that. Oh, you look, oh, Domino. Domino. I'm doing, I'm doing a pizza for tonight. Um. Oh. Cool. Look, there's pizza right here. Yep. So. Are you gonna buy pizza for the rest of everyone? You wake up. Uh, you come out of the main room. Oscar's out there. Of course he did. Did you sleep in my room? No, he slept on the couch. He slept on the couch oh, in the main main space. Because nobody told him where to go. I got to sleep on the, my bed. <laughs> yeah, that was a nice bed too. Uh, oh my gosh, I would sleep on my stupid couch. Why? Okay. The um, Oscar, you're gonna go with, uh, Vala out through the tunnels and wait for us outside the city. Okay. Um, 
Is anybody else up yet, or is it just Oscar? I'm casting a spell in my room. I it's Oscar and you. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I'm up. I'm just you just hear me. Um. Like the, for like an hour, and it's very very <laughs> <then, I'm> lightning. <laughs> <laughs> um, and actually, as you as you hold the the hand axe in your hands, uh, at the end oh. there is you know you know the strangers like. Uh, in, in D1, yeah, yeah. Stranger's Transmat yeah, yeah, Effect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's basically what happens. Yeah. And then there is a large gray wolf in front of you with kind of a silvery pelt. I still have the name. And he kind of, he, lo he looks at you <laughs> and just curls up at your feet. Aww. <laughs> I want a wolf so bad. <laughs> You're putting the no cheese out. Like yeah. in real life. Like I actually <laughs> want a wolf. Are you guys coming tonight? Yeah, probably. Okay. She literally called me that. <laughs> like, so oh, what okay. are we doing? <laughs> I was like, well... Um, so I'm talking about Oscal while mm. they're doing their thing in their room. Um, Oscal, I don't want to make decisions for you. Um, but... Um, you'll kind of have two options. Um, as we... We're all heading north. Um, but eventually a group will be... Um, heading towards... Um, Al Shala, and you can go with them. Um, or um, what I would prefer <laughs> um, is I want to take you to a place where you can learn to hone your skills. Um, as an inheritor, you will be hunted. Um, and I think you should know how to protect yourself, how to use the skills you've been given. You've shown that you can fight, but there's always more to be learned. Okay. I will teach you what I can on the road about what you are, um, but I can't promise to teach you as much about fighting um, as where I would take you can. Make a perception check on your liberty. A perception well, Speaking of perception check, so um, with this thing, can, he, my can my wolf do a hearing and a smells perception check at the same time? Or yeah, is it, he just has it, he, like, if he's trying to, he's trying to, like, sniff out if there was, you know, blood on the ground recently, yeah. he has advantage on that perception check, or if he's trying to hear something, like, but he has I mean, advantage like, on that. Like, yeah, but I mean, I would have to pick one or the other when making one perception uh, check. It depends, depending on what you're looking for, like I'll if, tell you whether you have advantage or not. Oh, that's not okay. Can, can the wolf track, like, if I give him a scent, can he track, like, like, follow a trail? Yeah. I mean, it's limited as far as, as far as your roles go. Right, 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 right. I mean, just like that's an option. Yeah. How would that work? Um, I only rolled an eight. An eight. Yeah. All right. Like that. that would work. You give him a smell. Right, but I mean, like, what kind of a role would that? Would it just be a perception? It would probably be smell? a perception based on smell, because he's trying to discern the track and and like smell it, rather than looking okay. and discerning tracks. He's just going for smell. And then, so, is there like a like certain amount of time that he can track one thing before he gets tired, or is like because usually with like he set him on the task. Okay. Look. Dopeness. I'm loving this more and more. <laughs> I'm just gonna highlight tracking so I don't forget the tracking. All right. Cool. Okay. You guys wait for about because, dude, because, because you know how like my survival. You guys wait. You, you guys wait for about We're not forty-five more minutes, minutes. No. and then they come out. You can try to track, and then I'll be like, "Okay, here's my wolf." I'm, I'm just explaining a little bit about okay. things that I'm still gonna look up Anthony would have talked to me about. Um, find out what he knows about, like what all was told to him, and just slowly start to fill him right. in on. He knows that he stuff. he is the inheritor of some sort of an artifact. Yeah. Um, he knows that it's in the Titan's Good mines. Good thing we killed this lady um, before the wolf showed up, because so. honestly, we kind of would have been screwed. Um, yeah. yeah. Just the, he, he knows the very basics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. So, yeah. I'm just slowly starting to fill him in on bits and pieces, so. Um, right, over time, we don't have to play the whole thing. Yeah. Alright, so. Uh, you guys, uh. <laughs> you guys come out, right? um, it hurts. and Amari and Oscar have been talking out of the main room. Okay. I'm he comes out with a wolf, by the way. Oh, I was about to say, I'm going to hide the wolf. 
Oh, okay, are you going to pocket dimension him? Yeah, just for now, because I haven't figured out a name for him. Okay. I don't know how. Wait. So, so how, do I, just how do I summon him? You just... Like, the lady howled. Do I have to howl? No, that's not. <laughs> that was just her... That was just her interpretation. Do I have to act like an animal? <laughs> she, that was just her but interpretation. I, so in order to, like, summon it, it's telepathical, so I just think... Telepathic. Yeah. Telepathic. That's what I meant. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can, you oh, can just like snap your fingers, or you can. Ooh. You can just... I'm not gonna click my tongue because. Freaking. You got, you got a horse and a wolf. It's like on top. Serpicles, serpicles, like who is this? Yeah, you can just like pick up your fingers and just start bucking around trying to get it out. Oh dear lord, who is this? What is this monstrosity? Oh dear lord, who is this? What is this monstrosity? Okay. It smells. <laughs> I would imagine it. Wait, does it need to eat? Nope. No. Because it's not like real. It's like the best dog ever. You don't have to take <laughs> care of it. You <laughs> just clean up after it. You don't have you to feed it. You can talk to it like mentally. Like bruh. Telepathically. Like bruh. Bruh. Okay. This is, this is, this is awesome. Alright, so you bruh. and I are headed up to the city. Okay. Um. Talon, I need to send a message before we leave the city. Um, and so me and Alice are going to go through the tunnels and go to the north, right? And, and Vera, then where are we meeting? Vera, Vera, Vera. Oh, we have communicated, so never mind. Yeah. Alright. Um, yeah, so um, I need to find a post office. <laughs> oh, Josh knows what I mean, Talon knows what is. I don't know that. Miriam knows that, but I don't okay. think about it. Hey, Talon, does. tell her where... <laughs> I have been to the post office here. Oh, hey, that's handy. <laughs> okay. So you just want to take take me there? <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Sometimes what? it's cringy. I think I might have just like, set that to be like ready in like 15 minutes, and that might not have been a good idea. Yeah. All right. So you are taking Oscar Vala through the tunnels, I think. Okay. And now you make a perception check, since you are in proximity with him. Proximity with. Make a perception check. Oh, damn. Wait. Oh, no, it's a night. Am I wearing a mask? Oh, shoot. No, you're not wearing a mask. <clears throat> Twelve. Twelve? Okay. You notice he's a little more green around the gills. He does not, he looks a little under the weather today. On school? Yeah. This sentence really quick. So he's just, he looks, does he, he he looks steady. I can bring he Taco looks, Cat Goat Cheese Pizza. Because you, I have not played that. Let's bring Happy Salmon. Yeah, I bring can that. also bring Happy Salmon. Yeah. They're my fun games. Games. How many people are coming? And yeah, what are we doing? We're just hanging out <laughs> and eating food. Okay. And I'm apparently playing some games now. Yeah, I'm playing games. <laughs> I hope so. Anyway, yeah. there's, it's not a word. So, so with the percent, green, as in like he's sick? or Yeah, like, he just looks under the weather. A little ill. Not. Not on the top of his game. Oscar, did you... Did the spider meat take ill with you, or what? Because I know Amari and the other one. Yeah, the the other one? one? I can never remember your name when I want to. Kind of okay. I, no, I just don't feel amazing today. Do you know why? No. Did, what did you do yesterday, or what was, I mean, besides hiding in the room? I mean, meditated staying in the room. With Vera? She just sat there. And she just was quiet. It was weird. Yeah, well, people, people like to be quiet sometimes. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that came off like not it was all of what I intended. Some um, people like to be quiet sometimes. <laughs> as, we're, as, we're hint, <laughs> as you're walking through tunnels. <laughs> um, uh, um, your servant is accompanying you, by the way. He's about 30 feet. Showing you the way out. Showing you the way out to the, where they where their old camp was. Oh cool. <clears throat> um, and you did what did you eat anything? I ate the yes. normal food. Yeah, but we're not there. I don't know. I'm trained in medicine. 
I'm not. No, I'm not. That's my other D&D character. I put it in Madison with a plus two modifier. That's Remy. I have a plus two modifier. Amari. I apparently like to make characters that end in E. Amari. Remy. To be fair, Remy's full name is Remy Orr, but... Yeah. Okay. Do you, I mean, are you well, like, enough to travel, or...? Yes. You have no idea why you're... No. Sick. Do I see any, like... Like, any wounds that we might have missed that he's, like, in causing infection or something like that? No. He got bit by a radioactive spider. He's about to turn into Spider-Man. Radioactive. No. Radioactive. No. That's not what I said. And, uh, well, it is what I said, but it's not I was what like, um... Alright, he already right, right, right. has, like, the jumping ability. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Can you imagine... No, he just needs a stick to Can you imagine it with Spidey sense? Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tempt me. Yeah. Um, oh, what if my boots gave me Spidey sense? <laughs> <laughs> the Can't Peter Tinkle? Surprise. That'd be the Peter Tinkle. Don't, don't, don't call it that. Don't call it that. Don't call it that. Okay. Oh, that's what it was. So I guess if he's fine, we'll just keep walking. You can also just tell us about him later. Well, oh, yeah, I was going. To... <laughs> it's like communication. So I'm like, ah, uh, guys, I don't know how to uh, respond to this. <laughs> Alright, so I mean, as you, you, guys, are young, you guys are walking. Not, Don't like, do well with people being sick. Yeah. He told me he knew where uh, never to send sick. letter or I communication. Never. So My you guys walk out and you head um like that big. That's like you head north. Or not north. You head out and you head West. East. West. East? Gosh, it's freaking heck. West. West. It's West. <laughs> I can't do it. Not wasted. <laughs> Um, Did you notice the reference in the Zootopia where, in it's, Zootopia the where it's, it's like Because yeah. it's the same voice actor. Yeah. Alan funny. Tudyk. Mm. Um, yeah, so you guys hit the main road and you see a little crowd gathered around the main dock area. Um, and there's... How far away? Uh, they're about 90 feet. We're all the way to the dock? We're, uh, no, no, you just, you just came... Kind of directly, you went, you went out. Like you guys? Where oh, you went out where you originally went in, and then you went west, and you're about, mm, and I'm like almost 150 feet. We from came out through the warehouse. Oh, you came out through the warehouse. Yeah, the, they yeah. went through the easy access one. Yeah, the one that's like uh, less okay, like. Just start we're just walking out. Around. We're just walking out of the sewers randomly. Yeah, we want to come out the warehouse because oh, okay. we want to be in the upper city anyway. Yeah. Okay. All right. We're I was wrong. Um, I'm just thinking. You say I feel like there might be some people at the dock right now. <laughs> <laughs> we should buy the building that the access is in and turn that into your brewery. <gasps> <laughs> so that it's not weird that we're going in and out of the building. And all then the kobolds, we can learn how to grow. Can we do that when we get back? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, yeah. I just, I just thought of this. City. I just thought of this. I just thought okay. of this. As we're like back burner. <laughs> oh, I guess back burner. Front burner, baby. No. Um, <laughs> you just like squash it. Like, like, no, <laughs> this is on hot. <laughs> <laughs> We're buying this now. Um, you just I, wait, well, well, I wonder what? who owns it. It's, it was a. It's an abandoned yeah, warehouse. It's like probably foreclosed because oh, tax okay. collected. Anyway, that was just a that was nice. just a I thought. Like as as... <laughs> um, all right, so you guys. Uh, as you guys hit the main thoroughfare, like, yeah, we're, we're right um, right. south oh, of the south of the Death Star, um, there is a larger than normal stream of people going south. Okay. Well, well it is. Let's see, we're in here. Yeah, we're coming it's, down. It's Mason, kind of coming down, and then we just like, go basically yeah. straight okay. west. So we're still in that direction. Cool. So. You head over to the post office, um, you walk in, there's still the package of, there's still a pile of packages to the side, um, and the little guy's not there anymore, there is a, uh, larger figure, um, Is it the larger figure that I saw? Yeah, yeah, he's, he's got glasses on his, on his nose, and he's writing something down. Um, well, there was two people there when I was there. 
All right, I got it in the front desk. Can I help you? Yeah, um, I'd like to send a message as quickly as possible, um, quite a distance. How much are you willing to pay? All the money. Um, well, let's find out how much it, it costs. Um, I want to send a message to that place you told me. On this you? He was at. Um, it's by name. <laughs> no. Where did you say he was? He was in the northern tip of Gallica. Okay, the northern tip of Gallica. Would I know Gallica. the city that I was taken to? Yeah. Okay, so that city yeah. that I don't know, because you and I didn't talk about it. We'll figure that out. Um, um, <clears throat> Alright. Um, um, that's quite a ways. How is. quickly are you wanting it to get there? Um, How quickly could you get it there? Yeah. Um, that's quite a distance. It is. How long of a message is it? It's a small piece of paper. Or one letter. Nope, it's not a package, it's just a letter. Um. We could send it with our pigeon service. Mm -hmm. It would take maybe three days to get there. Good, which wouldn't cost lots because it's not an actual person or horse that you're expending, right? Huh? <laughs> it would oh, run no. along the road. Wait, what? <laughs> she goes, which is, so it shouldn't cost very much because it's not a person or a horse. And he goes, mm-hmm. <laughs> Yikes. It would cost you $13,000. <laughs> so free because there's no dollars in this game. Yeah, yeah. It would cost you a gold to get it there in three days. Oh, cool. He's like, by pigeon? It was gonna cost me seven silver to get a letter to a Scott. letter, not a not a pigeon message. A letter a on letter. a shipment that was already happening. Oh, okay. Like yeah. this is a, this is special order. We're gonna send a pigeon like straight there. It's it's the express service. Okay. Okay. Pigeons are rare. You realize how how many pigeons work, Josh? They have to separate a love They're couple extinct. and then they have to transport that thing. Um. Okay. So um. Yep. Yeah, I will. So it takes a time. I will do that. So many. Um, All right. They're extinct. I they're rare. They're right. Stink. Out of letter. Well, they're Basically they're asking him to meet Post us. Post haste to meet us in Laravage. Yeah. Um, yeah, I have some, I I have thing, some work for you um, that I need done. Okay. Um, Do you name yourself or anyone? Yeah. Or I... Put Anthony's trainee and I draw really quickly the symbol. Okay. Alright. He takes it, rolls it up. No. I draw wings. Okay. Um, oh, whoa. No way. Do I, I need to give a name. They're actually... What? Am I right? For them to send it, because they'd have to know who to deliver it yeah. to. Yeah. The last um, okay. passenger... So, this is to go to... Um, it's the breed. Yenarin. But they're still... They do something... If, no, it's the breed that was yeah. used for homing vengeance. Is All right. Down. And you yeah. have it here. If you're here, here, folks, I was right and Jacob was wrong. Okay. That's what we said. Um, he he uh, <laughs> nods to you. Are you done? Yes. Are you doing anything done, sir? Your name, the last one. She died in the in the zoo. Do you need anything done? He's old. asking you. If they pay uh, the palsy, they mm. um, she had palsy. Yes, Ooh, I would like to send a letter. Um, to Ashala is how much of that can we cost me? And how soon could you get it there? Oh, we could get it there within hundred. Wow, this happened a hundred years ago. Yeah. You could get it there within two weeks. Oh, it's so hot in here. I'm actually chilly. I know. I'm sweating because I'm wearing a sweatshirt. Yeah, yeah, but I also don't want to take it off because it's not biking cold. You're sweating? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> too. <laughs> and my shirt doesn't smell the greatest because I was just wearing Kevlar for. Ten hours. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Don't yes. No I still have my Kevlar spray and I'm like, I need to just throw this away because I haven't had Kevlar in five yeah. years. <laughs> oh my god. Um, yeah. <laughs> but that stuff got spanky. So, I'm gonna send a, I am going to send a letter. Yep, sending a letter. Oh, send a letter to Oshelot. Okay. Very sending a name. That, that's a possibility. Um, I'm going to write that one down. Alexander Brewing. Okay. Yeah. Is that your dad's place? Or do you? 
Can I write it down? Yeah, go for it. Write it down, give it to me. Okay. Um, Alright, so he takes your guys' letters, he walks into the back, um, comes back a moment later. We'll be done. Alright. Uh, that's going to cost you seven silver, Josh. Thousand gold. Seven. Um, and then a gold for you. Yeah, I already marked it off. Alright, awesome. Yep. So. Oh. Where's Swahili? What? Did you just say what Swahili? Where? No, where is Swahili? Isn't that a language? Yes. Yep. Swahili is a language. I'm looking for languages, language. John. For names for It only oh. makes sense if you understand why I'm talking to Where's myself. Where's Swahili? <laughs> Where well, is you know, Swahili? when you talk to yourself, you say a lot of weird things. Okay. You should look Ooh, it up in Samoan. Ooh. I literally just, like, looked at Hawaiian. Is that the same thing? Or is it? No? Okay. I'm sorry, that probably offended all Samoans. <laughs> Um, like, it's I, not the same thing. I know how to say spank because my friend's Samoan, and so when he's like, I will spank your butt if you don't do this, so I'm like, I know how to say that phrase. <laughs> Which, Somal Somali if you saw Hobbs and Shaw, um, they spoke Samoan, and I was like, yeah. I know what she said! Because she says she's going to stop on him with her flip, with her slipper, yeah. which is her flip-flop. And I was like, oh my gosh, I feel like I'm with him. Oh, there it is. Right Sasa. Oh, it's come great. on! Sasa is, like, spit. They don't have, like, a translation for it? That's great. Alright, so, you guys just head out, and then back. That's back to go get, best. um, Ghost in his cart. Alright. So, you kind of head in, you kind of fall into the procession oh, of people that are heading south. Um, as you reach sort of the area of the Tubby Duckling, mm -hmm. you see a crowd gathered around the dock. Um, do you guys go... For ghosts, or do you see what they're gathering around? I like think we are go for ghosts. <laughs> um, challenge should be see what this is. I feel like I it might I might know what it is. Um, the group of people. Mm -hmm. Sure. Okay, it's not out of our way that much. It's just getting yeah. a little well, further south. Well, we're going right. Here. So you literally went to yeah. the, yeah, you are like, the tubby duckling. Like, it's like right, right, right. Yeah, so it's like right there. Right there. Yeah. It's like right there. Um, as so you, you need to be careful or just casual? Casual. Okay. As you move up, you see there are there is a ship that has been pulled up to the dock. Um, and the salesmen let down, but they've been ripped open. They've been cut and shredded. Um, portions of the rigging are cut to pieces. Um, there are various uh, bodies strewn across the deck. And you see, hanging off of the crossbeam, you see Ara, Pathami, the two pirates, and what looks like two more pirates oh. hanging from the crossbeam. <laughs> we got rid of some slavers. Oh, wow, that's large scale. Yeah. I can deduce that this is probably a display of... Oh, yeah. 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 That they, I think I'm... Yeah, you you can deduce that they took all of the slaves on board at night, took them while they were sleeping, and just hung the living and the dead from the crossbeam. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say Pythonia was already tanked. And they just they like they just defiled the ship, like they're yeah. they are privy to the ship they were riding on. Yeah. And so they knew which one to look. Number for. three. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. Well, yeah. I think that made it down things. That's true. Alright, so you guys grab Ghost. Um, he seems a little more uncomfortable than usual. Um, Can I... Uh, do I sense anybody? Anything? Make a perception check. More specifically somebody. It's not going to be easy to say. Perception? 18. Nope. Just more horses and... Okay. So, we should be grab the cart, head north, out of the city. Yep. Um, pass by the guards, they nod to you, and you are out on the open road north of uh, Kalanin Defensive Hill. Can we clarify where exactly the uh, entrance is so we can meet them there? No, we... We told him to go just into the wood, like into the woods, the edge of the woods, and we would contact with the stones. Oh right, we have stones. Okay. And by the way, you left the information on how to do underground farming. Yeah, with I the did. Cobalts. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you did. 
Yep. Oh my gosh, that would have been Ooh. so bad. Tana might be going to the hospital tonight. <gasps> oh yeah. Oh really? For a baby. Not oh, a bad I thought thing. she was. Sorry. Oh, my no. God. Like, she's. Woo she's I'm due. Like, ah. <laughs> she, her due date is Thursday, but they won't. They were potentially not even going to let her go that long because she has big babies. But baby left she baby. just messaged. They're like ten pounds. Um, she births bowling balls. <laughs> The cutest bubbling balls. <laughs> um, oh, for real. All right. That's that's one type of reputation to have, I guess. All right. So, you guys, I it, it's not hard. You guys find each other. Uh, you are now on the road north of uh, Clinton Defense at all. It is uh, morning. Um, and... Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. About a mile away. The road disappears into forest that is on top of a sheer cliff. So it kind of it travels kind of along the coast a few hundred feet from the cliff, but there's a forest up to the cliff, and then there is just a drop off of rocks on the bottom. Please don't get pokey with. Um, the most impressive stunt. Um, yeah. So. That's how you know Matt likes her. <laughs> Should have just been instant death. Anyway, um... Well, I mean, the... She was a freaking goldfish. You're that right, but the goldfish went away and she she died below zero hit points. But if you die, mm -hmm. and you catch a revivify within a minute, well, you're alive. Wait, what? The there, there is, there is a whole... on Critical Role, the druid oh, jumped off God. a cliff, okay. and you can like... literally turn into anything, like, really and she about? chose to turn into a goldfish. And everybody's like, she what? She splats. Because it's a 300 foot she drop. Has, she has 123 hit points. She takes 400 some odd points of damage. That is instant death. It knocked her unconscious, right. and it's her maximum. into a whale. She could have turned into like a An bird. Eagle? Yeah, <laughs> she, turned, she, turned, she turns into a goldfish. She splats. Literally, she jumped off the cliff and said that, and everybody's like, "What?" <laughs> so, so she splats, <laughs> and okay, the yeah, she. Yeah. So, so the stipulations of the revivify spell. I feel like if you went splat though, there'd be nothing left nothing. to right. revivify. Right. Especially, That's why I say you yeah. know Matt likes her. Yeah, and Especially like, goldfish. well, goldfish, and then you revert to your human form. Also, human once you drop below zero hit points in your animal form, so you go to zero hit points as an animal, yeah, and then you revert to human form. Yeah, she's been in fifty different pieces. Yeah, yeah, but it was just—it's so, anyway. this whole thing. Anyway. That's absurd. And Shoot, you could have turned it. Hilarious. Actually, that would be actually even better. Wait, what's the? You probably could you get away with turning into like a worm? And would it reduce because you're like light enough that you like? No, no, no. Terminal so velocity for anything is it's gonna, a couple thousand feet. Like it's it was a hitting fall water drop. is gonna be like hitting concrete. Well, yeah, that's true. So yeah, yeah. It w but it's just it's just one of those yeah, that, like, it's one of those things it's, like it's infamous. Because yeah, why didn't you like, just turn into a bird? Of all the because fish go in water. <laughs> no, but they're not magnetically attracted to it. I don't know. It's a thousand feet, Also, wait a minute. A goldfish? <laughs> it's just what so kind of water was it? Seawater. A goldfish <laughs> wouldn't even survive <laughs> seawater. Welcome, welcome to the internet. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Are you serious? All right. Even so, if she survived. I love Marisha, just... but in that, in that moment, I'm just like, what in the world? Oh my gosh. But yeah. Yeah. So just whenever somebody talks about turning into something, I just always joke about or it. Cliffs. Oh, shit. Or cliffs. Or cliffs, yeah. Right down the lane. Oh, so I said don't be a Marisha and like try hey, to jump off a cliff. The, what was the... The healing god person? Did you um, use? Artemis. Artemis. And what, what mythology did you use for that? Greek. He's using Greek mythology. Um, so we just see it... I mean, I feel like we're just traveling. Yeah, so, I mean, I was just kind of telling you what was in front of you. Uh, uh, uh. I thought you were looking for a reaction to the cliff, other than, don't be a Marisha. <laughs> um. No. Nope. That was just letting you guys know where you were. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so. Uh, you guys keep going for the day. Um, I would like you guys to make perception checks. Okay. Uh, whoever's, whoever's leading, whoever's, like, driving the cart. Uh, make a perception check, and if someone helps, make it with an edge. <laughs> we all have done it now. <sighs> Just freaking miss the table. Yeah. What? Yeah, so, you can do it with advantage. Yeah. Cause, well, ooh, that's nice. Wow, 
I mean, you neither way though. Perception? Yep. Yeah. 22. 22. Alright. Oh, good lord. Okay. What's that? What's that? That's his letter. He oh. literally just wrote the letter he's sending. <laughs> I was like, meet us in this city ASAP. Like, a Tony's training. Why is this different? I could've... A Tony. And Tony. Okay. Yeah, so it did change. Yeah, that's easy enough. Alright. So, you go for the better part of six or seven hours. Travel about 20-ish and miles. And it's just the four of us? Just right? the four of us in the Oh, wait, race. we have Vera, right? Yes. Five. Sorry. Yeah, five. No, we just left without your wife. You well, She's so used to being without her now. Oh, well, I just forgot that we were taking her with her. It's yeah, with us. If you guys table. want, I, I have nine good berries. If you guys want to eat them, that way we don't have to stop for food. If you just give me sounds like a good berry. That is true. So... Can we do that? It's I'll like a that. super OP spell. By the way, if you cast it tonight, you recharge your spell slots in the morning, yeah. and they are good until uh, yeah, tomorrow night. Yeah. Here, so. Okay. All right. Just, make, just making sure you you cut. Yeah, it's by seven o'clock is when my time runs out. Right. Right. So as long as you recast it, if you recast it tonight, you take a long rest, you recharge your spell slots, and you start doing So I have four blueberries left. All right. So no one needs to eat for the day. They are nourished. Um. <clears throat> so yeah. Anything you guys are doing during the uh, time? I want Holler, not Hillary. Come on. So, Talon, you're driving the cart. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. My mule. So. Sounds good. My mule. Um, yeah. And you, as you progress throughout the day, I mean, they've met Ghost once now. So. As you as you progress throughout the day, Ghost becomes a little more amiable and not as uptight. Okay. So. Alright, so, uh, you guys make camp, um, start to get tired, 6, 7 o'clock, something like that. Um, you've got about, you guess, 20 or 25 miles, something like that, around there. Okay, do we know how, how far La Vivage is away from where we are? <laughs> Two inches. <laughs> I'm gonna put that uh, into feet and do a bunch of maths and into feet. Yeah. That's feet. how I say it. <laughs> don't make fun of us. I would have said the exact same yeah. thing. I saw this quote the other day. Well, I like, don't like it. It like, hurts me when I'm intentionally trying to make it sound right? funny, okay? It ticks me off so much. I'm like, Josh, just Well, because go sometimes with it. I can't tell if you're actually doing it on purpose or if you're just doing it. Um, um, that'll take you to get to La Ravage about eight or nine days, depending on how fast you travel. So just so, no. Nope. Okay. I don't know what to tell you. Why is that not working? What are you, what are you looking at? I'm trying to come up with a name for my, for my gotcha. No, no, I'm talking to you. Oh. I know what you're trying to do. It's very obvious. <laughs> well, I want it to like mean something. All right, so. I mean, I'm also pulling ideas from John Wick, so. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Dog. Get over here. No, yeah, I'm just going to name him Wolf, but in a different language. <laughs> I mean... Alright. So, okay. you guys make camp. Do we... You are. I will recast before we go to Do we... So do we'll uh, just let me know whenever that is and what time it is. Yeah. Um, if you just, you, uh, yeah. You, you have more good birds. You make camp for a away from the road or near Right, but I need to know what time that is. Um, How so if we're still doing I mean, something. We're traveling well, we don't want to go too far from the road because your cart probably wouldn't do yeah, like yeah, like yeah, your, your no, berries will expire before you cast uh, again. You don't need it, them again, necessarily. You know, if we go a little like, ways. Right, right, right. No, I'm, just, I'm just saying, just I just want to make sure I know when the time is. Let him determine how far off So, because they're still talking and debating doing stuff. So, until I know we're going to bed, just then I'll know what time I cast it. Sound good? Oh, right. Simone, that's right. So, as you guys set up camp, you light a small fire. Um, you are nourished for the rest of the day. Uh, it's it's so weird, honestly. Around. You just eat one berry and then you're just good. Welcome to the world of magic. Um, yeah, so. Oh, that is coming. Cool. You are. I'm not going to go with that. I'm going to go with this one. Um, camp. Anything you're doing? Figured it out. 
Oh, sweet. I don't know. Is there anything that we need to do? I don't think there's anything we need to do. Is there anything anybody wants to talk about? <laughs> About maybe like, where, like the next what couple of days. Do, I don't know what we're okay. Um, well, we're heading to yeah. uh, La Rivage. Um, I have someone I'm hopefully having meet us there. Um, something that will help Oscar. Um, and I guess it doesn't really matter. I can tell you. Um, <laughs> basically, um, to give Oscar um, a tattoo. Um, <laughs> I mean, you can. This is a particular... It just won't do anything. I don't know. Well, I don't know. It depends on what you're looking for. Um, for us, <laughs> you saw Oscar's <laughs> feathers. Um, yeah. For people That's who want to be called. discreet, feathers coming out of your back. Awesome. Lacks discretion oh. <laughs> when you're trying to mask what you are. Um, this man um, is. I don't know if that's possible. What? No, I have an idea to run by Justin. Gotcha. Later. But basically, he's um, a an uncommon form of magic tattooing, which will um, get rid of the feathers but allow him to still. Use his wings. So, so like, um, basically turning into a tattoo. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. Um. I guess I like. I'm a girl, so this is a little bit harder. But like, <laughs> I show you my back. Right. And okay. cool. what covers basically my whole back are these two wings, um, yeah. tattooed in. That's cool. Yeah, that um, would be harder to do, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I can't just be like take my shirt off and show you. Um, and the two girls in our group. So I could no, I'm not gonna say that. I, don't, <laughs> no. I don't know who all knows about this tattoo artist. Um, it sounds like there are a couple of them, perhaps. Um, but I did notice the same tattoo on the back of um, the Ruby Phoenix. When he um, showed off his pectorals. <laughs> yeah, when he lost his shirt. In the fight, <laughs> um, to the gotta woo all the women in the room. Woo! Um, I mean, but yeah, some of the men, let's be honest. Come on, son. That's true. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so I also want to find out if he knows anything about this guy. If he gave the tattoos to him, um, and I want to ask him some questions that about that sense. as well and get some intel. Um, Oscar, like I gotta tell you, man. Um, it's gonna hurt. Yeah, it doesn't feel good. Uh, well, I mean... And I don't think right have now. been invented yet. Yes. <laughs> right. Can't give um, to morphine. There's magic anesthesia. <laughs> I mean, let's be real, when it first came out, it was pretty magical. Witchcraft. <laughs> 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 <Yeah>. um, <laughs> but... Um, it'll do you good, I think. How are you feeling, by the way? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. At some point, I'm gonna be like, "Hey, so this guy was like a little green around the edges." I don't. Is he getting worse? Uh, that's what you can tell. Oh, okay, good. I, I don't. He just has to play. All it's the time. good. You see a little more. You see, it's like a couple beads of sweat on his brow. Um. Tell him to take a look at him. Entirely. Yeah. Time. Yeah. Tell him to take a look at him. You healer. Stop hitting me. No. You don't make me. Now, now, children. Shocker, there's metal. Yeah, I can. Ah, dang it. Well, <laughs> do you want help? This like, poor I kid assist, is never going to get there. I could assist you. I yeah, mean, talent. it's an A. Well, I could so assist you. Can, can you I assist with that? Well, I mean, who is proficient in medicine? Or, I am. Yeah? I have a I plus mean, one. Yeah, you can. Help him. Yeah. I just look over his shoulder, can, and that gives him help. You can give. You can give him advantage. Okay. Oh, good, that was a I swear, if you mess this up, no, that'll work. Boom. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Nat twenty. <laughs> his first one was a two, which makes it a twenty-six. Yikes, brother. This is um, awesome. I shall heal whatever ails you. <laughs> <laughs> he like. He's like. Well, guys, I didn't mean to tell you. He's like missing a leg. <laughs> he's like. Nah, I, I got know. It. I, got I have it. green. You know how, like, with Mr. Miyagi, where he just, like, 
And he does this thing and then just magically kills yeah, him. Yeah, that was cheesy. Level 20 cleric. <laughs> <laughs> Greater restoration. <laughs> um, I this look is, at you and you're better. This is a... <laughs> <laughs> sound. That's um. I'm trying so hard not for that to shoot out of my nose. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been good TV. <laughs> that would have been amazing. We would have to keep that. <laughs> that would have hurt too, like the. Yeah. Yes, yes, it would. Carbon. Oh, oh, I've had well, really I mean, come by this point, there's no carbon. There's not really carbon. Right. So, um, still, this is some form of a degenerating spell effect. Um, has affected him. Um. Do I know how to fix it? Like a degenerative? Like a de yeah, like like oh. some sort of a... You said degenerating, and so I was like, I don't know what that is. Degenerative? What? De degenerative. Degenerative. Yeah, degenerative right. spell effect. So something that causes him to just get worse? To not feel good at all. Oh. Yeah. So Is this it going is, to continue to get worse? Um, From what you can tell, no. How long has he been under this? Um, he has been basically just affected, and... Um, he's, it's, it's basically just kind Will of... it just wear off? From what you can tell now. Do I know how to fix it? Uh, what pills do you have? None that he has Does it perchance have... Lesser restoration? Does it rem... What, what does it remove? A disease. A disease... Or effect? Oh, I still have to pick a spell! Oh my gosh. I'm such an idiot. I don't think you have it prepared. I, was, I might have peeped at your spell list you wrote down. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. Uh, I mean, these are the only Wait, healing it's a level have. one, right? Any level yeah, one. Yeah, you take a level one spell. Oh, these yeah. are all the level ones. But yeah. <clears throat> okay. Oh, so many options. No. It's all I need to look through the, the other spells. Here. Here. Not on camera so that I can figure out exactly if I want to swap any of them out. Oh, these are what you have prepared. Yes. One yes, he doesn't have it prepared. If you're looking for what I think it is. So I don't need this one because... Does he have greater? Greater? Yeah. No. What is... what? Okay, well specify for me what lesser restoration does. That's what I'm trying to get to. Right, okay. <laughs> Patience. So. Um... I have... Some of these I don't need to necessarily have right away because I have the chop. Mm -hmm. So like this one and this one. And, and some and of them I have. And some of I have <gasps> also. I don't know if I should. So like I have that one. I don't want that one. I kind of been debating and I have this one. Which one are you debating? I hate the thorns, but I haven't really read up on it. And the Hunter's Mask one, that I heard. Mark. Mark. Thank you. <laughs> I'm tired. Um, Hunter's Mark, I already kind of have with the axe, correct? I believe that is what you have, yes. One condition or one disease afflicting a condition can be blinded, blinded, deafened, paralyzed, or poisoned. That's lesser restoration. Um... This diamond with the C, that means concentration, right? Yes. Can we go? <clears throat> and this is up to three. I don't have any three. Yeah, no, I don't have any three. Yeah, you have a three because you're supposed to jump together. Well, I don't need them because these are above three, level three. So. It's level three. Yeah, some of these are on level three. Um, from what you can tell, that would remove some of the effect. Which one, the lesser restoration? Yeah. You know what, I'm an idiot. I can just use my player's handbook. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um. Alright, so at the very least you'll have to prepare it. Yeah, so you wouldn't be able to do it till tomorrow anyway. Alright, sounds good. Alright, so, um, and can I have... Uh, so who's taking watch, if anybody? I'll do it. Okay. First shift, I can take second. Okay. So. And... That's it. You really what time is that? To... What's that? What time is that? It's... So recast. It's probably 8 p.m. So point. greater restoration gets rid of an effect like charmed or petrified. A curse, including targets attunement to a cursed magic item. Um... 
anything that would cause a reduction to the target's ability scores or one oh, effect right. reducing the target's hit point maximum. Oh, no, that's level 5. Okay. And it yeah. consumes a diamond that matters like 500 gold. And it is oh, yeah. 8 p.m. Um, but. And I'm just going to eat the rest of the other four berries at that point. Okay. Um, Alright. So, uh, for people taking shifts, uh, I need a perception check. So, it's in the five. first one. Um, 16. 16? Okay. I always forget that. I just need to 12 for me. 12? Not amazing. What was I going to do? Well, yeah, I mean, hey, let's not discredit. What are we rolling? Oh! Wait. Can I? Because nobody else, everybody else is asleep, right? No, you're watching. Yeah, okay. Can I, use, I'm going to use my companion and also make a perception check with him. Can I do that? Uh, yeah. Okay. I would like to do We're that. just taking watches. Right, yeah, yeah. yeah. I was letting him know because okay. he was asking what we were rolling. I have to double check. He's a plus three as well, so I think. Um, yeah, okay. And he is a 19. 19? Um, nothing happens through your watch. Okay. Um, he. What's his name, by the way? I'm not telling anybody yet. Okay. <laughs> um, through the night, uh, he remains, but he is... Well, his name is Wolf. Wolf. Well, really? What? Yeah. Um, In the common tongue. <laughs> he, uh, he kind of circles the camp a little bit sort of while, uh, while you sleep <laughs> and while she's on watch. Um, oh, yeah, that's true. I guess I, you could just do that. Yeah, yeah. Um... About um, about halfway through your watch, Amari, you feel the ground kind of shake a little bit. By the way, not disconcerting at all. You should shake some more. Like a, like an earthquake, or like is it a steady shake? Or sorry, I'm not. That's okay. Sleep. If an <laughs> enemy moves within 60 feet of us, everyone wakes up. Oh, that's true. What? My sword will wake you up. Ooh! Um, that's cool. Wow. See, we cannot, still if you're within, if you're within 30 here. feet of me, you cannot be surprised. Pretty dope. It's pretty How awesome. come that didn't work with the... Um, what's her name? When stab me back. Stab me back. Because it was like more like a sneak attack. Yeah, it was. It was sneak oh. attack. Oh, so you're, you're saying you? It was. It was a. It was a intentional surprise attack. Right. Okay. Um, because she acted when you guys didn't know. Uh, maybe change better. Do you? Uh, you sit there, kind of. What's that? Talon, Vala, all of a sudden, you are. Uh, something intrudes in your consciousness and prods you awake, and you instantly, you're awake. You feel it as well. Right, but I'm um, already awake. Yep. <laughs> it, it's our Peter Tingle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Which is so all the time talking about Spidey sense, and I didn't even think about like, the fact oh, wait, that I, I basically have, have it. Um, and you, you have detect magic, right? Yeah, he does. Yeah. yeah. All of you feel. This rumbling going stronger, and it's more of a. We're about to be attacked by an army. We made camp just off the side just of. Off the road. road. Yeah, yeah. Because his cart probably can't go super far into the woods. No, so. that's right. We're carrying a freaking cart. Um, and as driving, the, yeah. the ground shakes at intervals, the the fire kind of begins to, the, the ember, more embers start coming off of it, um, and suddenly a wolf comes out of the forest and goes and stands by Vala. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? It's a wolf we saw earlier run at us, right? Right. Yes, it is exactly the same. Yeah, I draw my swords. 
Um, you see, you see Amari draw her sword. The last time we saw this, it tried to kill us. It also just evaporated before it could do anything. So, I'm just so then saying. why is it here? Because. <laughs> because I want it to be here. Back off. Wait, why do you have it? Because it's a woman who means nothing to me. Um, she means nothing. Her, nothing her, her hand axe is, 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 is called Fang. And I have a wool animal companion now. <laughs> Out of the earth, about 15 feet away from you guys. <laughs> a large clawed, it's, it, the, the fingers are about probably about this long, and there's large claws coming off of them. Big old gauntlet looking arm. Is this a golem? It, it it's it's curved back, pushes out of the ground, like and these large werewolf. mandibles come forward. Um, cl- the claws on its on its left uh, large hand um, are are almost icy blue and steam a little bit, um, and its large mandibles click together a couple times. And it wait, pulls, what kind of a head does this thing have? It pulls it. It's almost bug like. It has it has it almost like, like fly carapace. eyes. It's like a um, and it's got this ridge running down the back of its back, and you see these successive it's armor plates. Um, and as it pulls the rest of its body out, it towers over you. It's probably a good 15, 16 feet tall. Um, large armor, um, large claws. One of its eyes is missing, um, and you see both of the mandibles are... One of them is kind of broken off a little bit, and the other one has just like what looks like old dried blood on it. Wait, so it is it is fifteen or fifteen-ish feet. Fifteen-ish feet taller tall. or tall. tall? Tall, like from the ground to the back to its back. So it's ten feet bigger than you, give or take. Yeah. Yeah, and that is where we're going to end. Yeah, of course. Today.